Hey, what's going on in the fast lane? Thanks so much for putting together this video on how to install the 100cc big bore kit. Uh, I know it's been a huge help to me so far. I did want to create this uh, video in response to minute 32 and a half or so of uh, your video where you talk about the extraction process for these rocker arm bearings. Uh, so uh, if you think this video is helpful, maybe you can include a link to it in an annotation uh, around minute 32 or so uh, when you talk about the process. But as you mentioned in the video, these uh, these these arm bearings are a huge pain to take out. I know that you and like you said, they don't unscrew. I know uh, the strategy you proposed was to go ahead and uh, bang them against the ground to loosen them that way. I did that and it did. I uh, was successful in loosening the larger arm bearing enough um, to pull pull the rest of it out myself. This smaller one, on the other hand, uh, only uh, was loosened to a certain point and it wouldn't come out any further and it wasn't poking out the top um, for me to be able to grab it. Uh, and in the process of knocking this thing against the ground, I mean, I, I just, I did some damage to it, uh, which I'm not too happy about. Um, so hopefully this tactic uh, can be helpful to someone who's looking for an alternative to knock it against, uh, knocking it against the ground. Uh, if you look inside these rock arm bearings, they are uh, threaded, it's a 1032 thread. So what I did is just ran to the hardware store, uh, picked a couple of these uh, 1032 bolts up and uh, go ahead and take it. And I screwed it in this uh, smaller one here since I wasn't able to knock it out. And uh, go ahead and screw it in as far as it'll go. And then from there, I just took a vice grip. Um, I don't really care about the threading on these bolts because I'm probably not going to use them after this, but keep screwing even further and you'll get to the point where it won't screw in anymore and you'll simply start rotating the rocker arm bearing inside the fixed seat. Uh, so go ahead and keep screwing as you pull out. That's what she said. And you'll see that the rocker arm bearing starts to come out that way. Uh, and from there you can go ahead and uh, go ahead and replace your uh, rocker arm with one that comes with the kit. So anyway, hopefully uh, this is helpful. Uh, again, I'm, this, I'm sure this is not the, the best way to go about doing this. This is kind of ghetto, uh, but uh, it's worked for me so far. We'll see if the bike starts after the installation. But anyway, thanks again, and uh, take care.